Peace fam, how are you? Hope all is well. Checking on you guys, checking on you guys. Check this out, right? I just got this, um... You ever had that aha moment? Like, now everything starts to make sense. Remember I told you because today, well, it's after 12 here. But anyway, yesterday, or still today, right? Um, is my son's degree day job, right? So check this out. George Floyd, right? I didn't realize today was his degree day. But it gets deeper than that, right? So today is his degree day. He returned. He was born in the year I was born, right? But he was born on my son's degree day, which is October the 14th, right? My son was born October the 14th of 1998. He returned May 25th of 2000, okay? George Floyd returned on the same day, May 25th, 20 years, right, after my son. And they share the same degree day. Now, let me break this down for you. Once I understood that, remember I told you I was feeling strange and I still feel strange. I've been feeling strange since all of this came about. But what really set it off, right, once I understood that much, right, is I went to the cosmic clock once again, right? So in the cosmic clock, if you look at, we're now in the energy of Libra, right, which they were Libras, okay, but if you look at what time it is on the cosmic clock, right, then we know that there's a relationship between a Libra and a Gemini in that sense because they both returned on the same day, 20 years apart, right, so now when you look at that and you look at this year is the year of Obatela or Obatala, which is judgment, right? And the opposite of judgment is Gemini, right? Or um, uh, what we call Legba. We also, um, when I got a reading done, right? Because of the day he was born, right? I got the reading done. And on that date, they said that he was um, considered what's called the Ngunguns. The Ngunguns is like the ancestors when the ancestors return. So what I'm saying to you is the day that George Floyd returned was what we call the Ngungun ancestral day, right? Where they come visit the planet um, and, and foresee certain things in, in our culture in our culture right so i found that very amazing to know that's um george floyd's mathematics and how it related to my son's mathematics and why i feel so strange but now it all makes sense uh mathematics don't lie uh nothing is a coincidence and i'm telling you he returned this year in gemini which is the opposite of sagittarius right not only did he return in you know that energy my son who was born the same day uh, 20 years ago who returned right um returned on that same day and that day is really where and i went to oyo tunji and got the reading it was called known as the day of uh the return uh, ancestors the return of the ancestors right so um I wanted to share that with you guys. Let me know what you think. What do you think about that? I mean, am I just, you know, um, overthinking it? I don't know. It, it just seems strange. You know, like I said, once again, he was born October 14th, 1973. I was born in July of 1973. However, my son was born July, I mean, October 14th of 1998. However, he returned October, um, uh, uh, May 25th, 2000, George Floyd uh, was murdered uh, May 25th, 2000, 20 years from job. It's return, okay? I just wanted to share that with you guys. Keep your vibrations high. Um, built with you soon. Peace.